Good morning, everyone. Uh, so we are going to uh, begin the uh, session after lunch. So we will uh, start from where we stopped uh, on uh, research objectives. So let me hand it over to Professor Saman. Uh, Can I do this? please tell. So we general objective states what is expected to be achieved by the study in general terms. So don't make general objectives specific. Yeah, take a more there. The object is possible to and advisable to break down a general object into smaller, logically connected parts and take a the object don't jump from one to other. So this uh, just tell the social market characteristics, then various things and connect logically, don't jump around. Uh, and as we discuss, then comes to the literature review. So we talk that introduction or background or justification. Basically, it is why you have to do the study and why you are doing the study. So, why you have to do the study is basically problem statement that it is a problem and why you, the, you are doing, you have to do and why you are doing it. Most probably because no one had done it or there is a dead gap or whatever it is to fill the gaps, then objectives come. General objective is kind of basically. Uh, Link it's, it's most of the time it's the um, topic and specific objective is small pieces. Some people, I mean, contest this also, but usually a lot of people think it has to be measurable action works, right? Otherwise, you can't achieve. And because specific objectives are uh, breakdown of the general objectives, things that are not in the general objective can't come in the specific object. Right? And then come to the literature review. Again, as we discussed, introduction, you use the literature to justify the study, but literature review is more uh, additional kind of information on the current status of the problem. And in a journal article, actually, you don't have a literature review and uh, justification kind of two parts, mainly because in a journal article, uh, you don't have that much space to write. So you only write a statement on your general objective and uh, then just go for the methodology. But uh, in uh, literature, especially PGIM, a lot of things you have a uh, separate chapter on the literature review. So the literature review should provide a critical assessment of the literature in a particular field, stating where the weaknesses and gaps are contrast in the views of particular authors or raising questions. So again, a lot of us like literature reviews, we just from one paper to the other, giving this paper said this, this paper said this, you know, but actually. Literature, you should be a critical analysis of all literature. Not telling that this, 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 but a lot of us doesn't know to do that. And we don't do it, right? That is where again we fall into trouble or problems, what to take and what not to take. Big problem. And we are to search and we are not to search. All this is there. Again, this uh, one main problem is problem of time. So you have to spend a little bit of time on the literature search also. But again, remember literature search, doing literature search, selecting articles, both is linked with uh, your objectives, right? So don't go and do a literature search, which is not in the objectives, no point. And they are, so it will not, not just be a summary, but will also evaluate and show relationships between different material so that key themes merge. Literature will a solid background for research papers, investigation. <coughs> Comprehensive knowledge of the literature of the field is essential to most research papers. So this is that what I'll do is 
this is just made a uh, point on the literature review. So it's a succinct survey of the literature related to the topic you are researching. Research. It address same content or concept, but objectives are different. Geographical location, different and present historical background test the research are basically what you can search for, and there shouldn't be any plagiarism. And it should show awareness of the existing knowledge of your field. And major authors and researchers and their ideas and findings, who, who, how and when other relevant studies have been done. So this is basically is your idea of finding out the literature review. Now remember, we are talking about the literature review for your one chapter of your research, but literature review is also important in selecting even the topic and what you are going to do right so both are linked with literature review because when you get a topic for you to find out whether other people have <clears throat> done anything also this is important right but now we are talking about after you have decided on the topic and also you have finished objectives also but They cover a nidala pin, then most probably mutton in the end. So, organizing the literature review, <coughs> it should be according to your objectives. Are three ones why the theoretical conceptual reviews deal with authors who have discussed the theories and elaborated the main concepts of your study respectively. Empirical review requires you to discuss authors who have actually undertaken first hand research on your study. So that is two important things. People could have given ideas about your area while people could have actually collected data. So in a literature review, once you start getting papers, you have to be selecting them for your review. They are, you basically include your inclusion and exclusion criteria. Right? Then, so say, I can say, I only take articles that actually have actual primary data. So all the, the empirical and conceptual ones, I don't take. So that kind of things, you can put them restrict. This is like when you are selecting Participants, you study, you say, this I don't take, this I take, that kind of things, because all you don't have to take. So in literature, you also, you have objectives, right? So this second part, first hand research on your study or have primary data, you can take. Sometimes some reviews, some papers have secondary data. The researchers wouldn't have gone and collected actual data. But they have used other people's data, public data. Again, you can say my review, I am only taking research where actual people have been measured. Right? Again, this depends on your thing. And presently in the literature review, the literature should review should show mastery of the authors in your field, their research and major findings, and how these lead to your own study.
Now, literature review bulletin in other countries, they pay a research assistant sometimes for even a year to do the literature review. So, it's not an easy thing or a joke or just two words because it's because you get a lot of articles. <clears throat> then you have to read all the articles because you can't just take and read the abstract thing. So, you take the abstract, so speed the abstract from abstract things. These, these are basically uh, interesting or good, then take all those and every single article you need to read. And then you have to basically, uh, it's a lecture pool, you can make a kind of a data sheet, say first take it in an article name, the authors, journal, topic, year of publication, then about the data, everything then has to be when you summarize, you get review. Meta analysis is the statistical analysis of a literature review that all literature reviews doesn't need to be done. But there is a thing called Cochrane Review, which publishes a lot of reviews. So go there and you and you also can register a review there from your name. There are two nang then a bit of diabetes cell and work career again. Review a current known. You can basically go and register your name, but the problem is almost all reviews someone has registered their names. So once you register the name, then you can do the review and then submit the review to them. Cochrane publications is very good publications, and if you get a review there, you will be a kind of a big chap for I still don't know, so I call it chap. I don't know. Anyway, uh, go, so, so this is another thing you can do when you don't have anything else to do, but just visit Cochrane database and see Mangal road traffic, pedestrian injury scale. Done hit the digits about a long time back. See a what in a combination to check it or have me a cover register. And usually, uh, they they want usually experimental studies in Tamil, but a lot of areas where there are no experimental studies, you can use absorption studies also. Uh, minimum you need is two. If there is only one, you can do the second one and do the review. During which you have to write the review. But that's another thing for people who are interested in research and doing a review because in new area, there are a lot of things that you can conduct a review on. But it's a good publication. You will work out so, uh, an ability, creativity of you, grouping or determining where to present which literature is essentially your task. Right? So you also need some skill like uh, writing a good paper or uh, painting a good picture, there is your skill is also should be there. You may want to consider grouping according to ideas, dates, areas of study, but it is important that there is a flow of the ideas. Now, some people kind of from birth, they can write analytically. That is not trained anywhere. They can write. And there are some medical students also they can write. So they have their analytical mind. Some people can't. So there are various things we can do and can't do in life. But him, TNIT, him, uh, very easy to do these kind of things because they always analyze. Some people from, they can train themselves to do again, like reading a lot. Second things, you have to do is writing a lot because then English uh, in name. So I studied in Singhala, school Singhala, it was a medicine with an English anchor. So we still think, I still think in uh, Singhala translate to English and talk. A no? lot of us people who haven't studied in Singhala English, they continue to do this. But when you read, you when your vocabulary improves. 
But when you stop reading, you don't get the words even. So writing was the same. Start writing because once you get addicted to writing, you will start producing articles at a very fast pace. So, Mata connector Harikela Vidyaka Ada Karavana Pulang Muno. So, if you can push one person, forget about your MDs, you will get the MD. You mean that will be a huge achievement. And if one of you can be now almost finished or 24, that will also be a achievement. And then there is change be even a connect Hamunata, he Mataham Munakele, Manita, Taratian. Yagatana Mata Beria, Evatama change. So that will start happening uh, very fast because uh, you know it's nice to go and get uh, a, a free meal from the president. So this is an example as far as the empirical review is concerned about in decolonizing the curriculum in South Africa can quickly cited. He evaluates 20 years of efforts by post-1994 governments in dismantling the apartheid curriculum. And this is so. This is kind of an empirical review where he basically has looked at things and wrote an article. And ways to improve the literary writing skills is read extensively on your topic. No shortcuts. Make a summary list step. No, I don't know. Have you read uh, Harry Potter? Potpa. Makadi shortcut ne ni mudwe kam kiyo na. So similar same thing. So you have to spend a little bit more. Ipam kiwa. I think more than films the books are better. But uh, problem was unfortunately I first watched the films and then read the then your whole thing was biased by the picture. Ani patta jane thi bhabe potda kam kiwa na kiwa. So that's the event. So, best thing is read extensively on this topic. Now, remember, you have to be a specialist on diabetes, depression, diabetes, stress. Because then you have read extensively. Biggest problem is we don't have time to read extensively because of other things. Make a summary. List table of the authors in the field, their research focus, their objective, their finding when you observation reflections on their findings. So always remember when you read article, use your knowledge on research to critically analyze the article. Because sometimes the article might not tell the correct thing. For an example, it's a then it, we have stopped we Commit medicine stream, we have a, we have a one month clinical attachment. After that, we used to give a journal article and ask the students to critique it. So, students are here at the author's language, and these were very good articles published in very good journals. But the things the students did, if the authors were there, they would have basically gone and committed suicide. Because just because the articles were published in good journals doesn't mean articles don't have research issues. But I remember, Journal like a cutter writing, they are a yalu in you, they go in the article out, they get published. This happens anyway. Right? So, it's about a lot of articles have a lot of methodological issues. So, just because health take a medical legacy in the journal and a lancet, so just because there is an article in the lancet, don't think that is the best article. Effort at that time, but things change, and then always just go to the web after you go home. Then a lot of things you will understand. What is a review? How they have done it? Where they have searched? Like a question like a lot of search engines are there. And where they have searched and how they have basically presented it. Then box line diagram box Then uh, 
Then inclusion next to Megana, Megana, Mamacher, Silicon, Ekan Tamari. If you read a review article, you will know that is a review article, but that is summary is your literature review. And uh, it doesn't matter. Any field, read a literature review more, no, more than to take the information, basically to get to know how to do it and how to present it. And a theoretical review state the theory and the authors present the theory in its original form from the author's source. Thereafter, you can state the improvements of the theory by other theoreticians. So this is theory because everything has come to today, any area, from small, small additions to their primary knowledge. Someone starts, then if you take epidemiology, this is really a new field which started in 1800s because of the industrial revolution, a lot of diseases started coming. Then they wanted to prevent them. Epidemiology came. And epidemiology has slowly evolved to today's states. Initially, epidemiology was used to prevent infectious diseases, but then the non-communicable diseases started coming. Now it is slowly being used to non-communicable diseases. Right? And then becoming an important area in humans' life. So we are kind of an uh, unlucky group of people, humans, because we did a lot of things and controlled communicable diseases, then came non-communicable diseases. So now they are killing us. We have double burden because we have infectious and non-communicable both. Right? And then injuries also, so they are in large numbers. And uh, so conceptually, the same thing, present the concepts in your research. This may come from your topic. At a section on definition of terms into introductory chapter, after a survey of those who have discussed the meanings of the terms, present the one you feel best explain what the concept means. Right? And present other authors' meanings in case of their approach is different. Focus on new things they have added to the initial explanation. Where ideas meanings differ, make this clear and explain how it has been handled by others. How has most of the authors presented it? When you are sure you have exhausted the discussion of the concept, the different ways that such an idea has been presented, it will be good to make a stand on the idea you are adapting for your research. Right? So all these reviews have been done for you to give an idea, not to look at what other people have done. So that is why you need to critically analyze this and give you a conclusion. So it's not just reading a group of things and presenting it, but you finally need to give a conclusion also. And contributions to research, contributions to knowledge should be the final part of the review. It should give a general explanation of the literature. Identify the loopholes, hanging arguments and controversies because when you read in any area, you will get contrasting things with okay, cigarette biwama, cancer had in Nakila article, you know, if you start doing review, those articles also will come. So then you have to come to a final conclusion, what is going to happen. So, but you should always say that there are the side of the story also. This may have come from how the various critics, viewers of theories presented them different meanings of the concepts and finding of empirical researchers. What have you not seen in the review literature? What conclusion, controversial things you have you seen? Such questions which need further answers and for which you think your research can help should like should be presented here. So it's not, if you really do, you will get interesting things also in the literature. These may further be expanded in the section of relevant significance of this study. But I am going to ask it only once, I'm not going to repeat it. You will have to answer. Okay, question start. Washington washed Washington's woolies. While Washington's wife visited Washington, D.C. 
how many Ws are there in all? No. Well, come on, thank you. All of the W net. How many W's are there in all? <laughs> we can't target it because now a lot of people were slowly going to sleep. So I'm sorry. I should make them up. I got a big Spaniard, the Pinya, my Dikunum Katakan. Sir Poliscaro, I mean, I'll tell this in single looking. Poliscaro, Golipia, and Alison Potter Sanga Kali. Kaki, a Kali may never take the Poliscaro team for me. Company the Vetic connect in all light network dynamic push by the light. Where can Nakali? He was coming in the bike. Light material, Adam Moratli, no fear, Mogadanant. Es Punya Paliki, the Punya Paliki, the political Yanadan. A Punya Punya Palakamane and among others, somehow, you know, I have Winnipa Gil, Gidrigila, Punya Palaki, Lianeka, he learned from his wife. Then I police car and never mend his Punya Pala, I like nothing. Punya Pali and Buran, Tangalila, it just sick. No more company the column of the Suna Democratic company the Lian than in me. So I Yella, then Punyapal in the company the police car is interview, promotion interview. I think Prashim Mogadza and Altamse, Companji Vidya beat the Karakin and the minimum value. Mogadakar, monk, body, I think in a melee. Prashim Mogadza, she was shocked with you when I was calibrating a pile of bargain, calibrating a tooth, Companji Vidya, body, beat the can of the body of wet Latina, Marlena, Mogadakar. So, because and it would have so basically literature is summarizing a lot of people's ideas. And when you are trying to summarize a lot of people as yes, one problem you will encounter is all people might not have the same mind. Right? So then you have to critical, this is where the critical and a bit of provider can put up one idea to give present in the pool. But when you try say I did a comprehensive literature review, nothing was found. Don't write now in your thesis. A lot of Previous get a little bit angry because comprehensive kill can be. Or just search kill. Here that my job is no article because comprehensive literature you doesn't tell anything. But and then you have to critically analyze and come to conclusion. They can say everything. So therefore, literature review, a lot of people say this article told this, this article told this, scale you write pages. That is not a literature. And then one question all of us have is, we have to do the literature review and how to limit the literature review. That is directly linked with your objectives. Because your objective, then your methodology, your questionnaire, basically, we the questions you are going to ask, and then what results you are going to discuss, and for that, you need your opinions. So, both is, should be there in the literature review, and then that is it. So, basically, a summary of what other people have done, but a critical analysis by you. A lot of people have submitted their proposals with all your literature reviews, you can write as if definitely at the abstract. So I will uh, I go back, I will send uh, one conference maker down Sri Lanka, Julio Elena, SLMA sessions.
start submitting your abstracts right and then this abstract you can that uh, citation you can then go and put in uh, thesis also right and then uh, they need to the board of study supervisors will help you in writing the abstract mage number ekak gala gawa thiyena i gave you a card so anytime you can email us for support i will support you eka part uttara dunna nattam podda ne ai mokada gawa den kila podi But at the end, the IBIT scale is immediately responded. Okay, uh, so then therefore, in presenting the review, re you need to argue to carve out an important place for your own study. The argument is that if you do not identify a problem to research on, a problem that others have not already researched on, then your research is worthless. And justification. And justification. Okay, literature review. Okay, no, that matter. This is what basically justifies why you have to do or why you are doing the research. You need to tell your reader that based on the gaps in research, the controversies and our disparities in findings, there is need for you to undertake this research. to shed more light bring more facts you must keep an eye on what you mention here and link it to what you mention in the significance of the study and your findings and conclusions right so you are at the main slide deck you can copy paste no plagiarism into your justification and change the words that you want to change and include your study you will have kind of a part of your justification written Right, appropriate. You can change, and then where to search? Uh, start with research databases, Google Scholar, Scopus, and PubMed. Web of Science are some databases to start with for any research topic and literature. Really. Focus your search with specific database. Select two or three disciplines, specialist databases to conduct your research or comprehensive research. So, for example, sociology or something, something like that. So, you can decide on specific ones as well. Find books, theses, and more. So, literature search is not only internet-based, right? So, you go to PGM library. Lot of all theses appropriate ones they have a list. But they are in the internet also now. You have to read. Them. Right, and then you, that is PGM library or other libraries, uh, internet libraries also, other universities also have theses. Then there are government publications, books, and then very important topic textbooks. So this you can refer right personal communication. Can you can refer it's a accepted reference talking with people. Because some information you can only take from talking with experts, so this is where you need to get. So it is not only going to the internet and search, right? And then journal databases. So journal self databases. The Lancet ki regam you go there. They give all their journal articles, books, and gay literature. These are conference proceedings, theses, government documents, fact sheets, and bulletins. annual reports business papers informal communication blogs podcasts pamphlets reports and advice is not clear ah then hari and then government publications right so for help it is uh, basically help it is uh, basically So, how to search? Identify keywords. So, 
analyze your research topic or question, connect your search words while results with one or more search words, and then search, search for different word elements and improve your search results. All library databases are different and you can't always search and refine them. Same way. Again, takes time. Now, if you road traffic, there are road traffic accidents, road traffic crashes, motor vehicle accidents, motor vehicle crashes, right? And then, Kamokarevagi, uh, Koma gives information on road traffic accidents. So, if you read, put only two words, other things might not come. So, okay, so it's, it's kind of a huge thing. But a lot of us, especially me, we do very superficial ones, so you don't get all the much. So, and then, even Sri Lanka, if you get diabetes, there are a lot of publications in Sri Lanka. One main thing is for the Katulande, but there are a lot of people. So if you don't include for Katulande in publications, then diabetes, then there are some you have missed out. Can develop, there are a few people who have done. So that's the thing, even in Sri Lanka, uh, it all depends on where you search and what keywords you use. In search strategy, searching databases is a constant and structured manner will save you time. As your searching progresses and your searches are refined, your search history can be extremely useful. So always save your search history because after some time you might not know where you search and what you search. It can also improve the relevancy of results obtained as you reflect on your keywords and synonyms, synonyms and how these influence your search results. To develop a search strategy, you will need to define and write down your research question. What is it that you are going to search? For research, identify and keep a record of keywords, terms and phrases. Brainstorming your main discussion points to create concepts. Mind maps can help you tease out themes and keywords. Identify keywords, synonyms, use databases, SRE or subject headings. Determine the time frame from your research if needed. Consider what type of material you would include and why. And identify where we will search for information. So again, like anything, any project, anything in life, before even starting the search, you have to have a very kind of clear picture, process, or document which says this is what I'm going to do. And then, when you evaluate research while you are searching for relevant information, because this is another question you might ask. How do I know whether this article or this information is correct, right? Because when you go to the web, there are so much of articles. You are searching for relevant information about your topic. You will need to think about the accuracy of the information, whether the information is from a reputable source, whether it is objective and current. The basic criteria for assessing information in questions, you might want to think about the about are listed below. It should have accuracy, authority, objectivity, currency, and coverage. So accuracy, what is it? Whether it is reliable, error-free, based on proven facts, and can the information be verified against other reliable sources? Then authority, who's the author? Does he or she have the qualification to speak right on that topic? Is the author affiliated with the reputable university organization in the subject field? Is the source peer you the repeat? Remember, there are a lot of bogus journals which regularly ask you for articles. Always check the various ways to check. Also, check about the journal because if they say they are going to publish in one day, that can't be a good journal because you can't publish articles in one day. And objectivity, what is the intended purpose of the information? Information, facts, opinion, and the information bias. 
the bias is unfair estimate in other words. And then when the information published, current or outdated, and then and provide basic core in the coverage. So this is just something. And then citation. So this is you, you have used endnote or any other citation to software. So this is uh, endnote is one. Then there was reference manager. Mendeley now gives all uh, this uh, new word have Mendeley. So you can't do manually, right? So everything and when free active bar, it uh, get linked to those articles and automatically download also. Citation management software packages, endnote. It's a citation management software package. Use to store and manage references. Mendel is free. Ignore you have to pay not a huge amount, but it's free. And such review is an essential part of research. Many sources for searching helps in understanding, reviewing, and criticizing. There are many search sources and community those sources. So, so that's a kind of a brief description. Of the review, and these are the seven steps to produce a literature review. Identify your question, review discipline type, search, manage your references, critically analyze and synthesize. So, this is true. If you are writing the review as an article law, review as part of your MD thesis. So this is where basically I got this information that is about the review. Any questions? So it is possible to uh, demonstrate like very briefly, like say doing a literature review. You want to know any make it? Just take a minute. So, one way you can do is just put this. Make the connection. I make it thin only. So when you, so this is just basically, I want to find out information about road traffic accidents in Sri Lanka. Still, I don't have any objectives or anything. Right? So I just type this anywhere. So this is what I get. So this is already 2019, this much was there. 2020, this much was there. But the problem is, from where this came, I don't know. So I can go like this. These are all 
This is one thing. This is because World Bank. This is a World Bank publication. So you can. So we are as requested by the, I think you can see. So we are, they wanted me to do a kind of show how to do a literature review, which I just don't know, but I'm not And uh, so I just want to find out what having accidents in Sri Lanka, just put that in Google search and got some things. So I decided I want to look at this. So this is a World Bank publication. So it's a reputed place. They have known publish wrong data so I will download this and keep and then next part I have to read the whole thing off okay and so that is one thing and then so I do that again In as I told it or we discuss, no. this is not totally journal article because the information is there in other government publications and then other reports because journal articles will only have something. So if you want statistics that will be more available in every police data, government publication, which might not be in an article. The second thing I want to basically show you is if we can find a, so this is a publication, journal article. So this is abstract actually, and uh, basically this is publication by, you know, this actually Jati the kind of this wife, the chin. So, PJ and the ETA, no, this. so this is basically uh, abstract. Make this conference next year. If you are interested, this conference next one is next year in New Delhi. Safety 2024. <laughs> Promotion program put one or two abstracts and go there. New Delhi or the team. So, this is 2021. This is what I said. This this goes in injury prevention as an abstract. Injury prevention is a very good injury journal with high impact factor. So, this gets cited. Okay, just put in abstract does not prevent you getting citations. And this would have cited many times. Right, so we'll go to a journal article. So this is one way, but thing is it takes time. You have to read everything, first read the topic, then see whether it's an article or reliable source because people can put things and then select. it. So there are publications and this safe road reducing accidents is a newspaper article. So that's what you can take. Yeah. So this is basically a home part study because I get totals downloaded from everywhere. Just numbers. Total from 1930 to 2013, we did an acquisition. This lot basically published. And uh, this 
and the, uh, this is what I said, similar articles, there is a link. So when you take one article, you can do similar articles and then you will start getting. And then this from NCBI or uh, format database. And this is what I said. Then you get all these articles. And you can slowly collect your articles. And from each article, you can go to the next article. Likewise, you can go and road traffic accident with Sri Lanka is very, very basically general topic. So, if I'm interested in pedestrians, then I can say pedestrian injuries, motorcycle injuries. Likewise, I can sort of more specify the thing and slowly do. Problem is, this is basically takes a lot of time. Now, if you look at this, Meva Tokkoma Balani. This. So now, like you are. Okay, why not you do that? Your topic one topic. So, so this is. So there is another issue. So when you go to depression, it's mainly psychiatrist and your psychiatrist. All the authors. Okay. Yes. This is an eagle. Endocrine. 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 Then, and from here, you can go to similar articles. So now for an example, then if we go to imagine it was similar with the prevalence and qualities of depression among older urban communities, prevalence of chronic complications, they are restricted, prevalence of neuropathic food titration in diabetes. Now when you look at this. Lot of things are not really relevant to you and right and the it's what I want to make a only problem is now this is they are only given the free can you can go to the total article. So this is of the three thousand patients, seven hundred to even this is what I said you can first put the social demographic characteristics of the topic is prevalence of discussion and associated factors. They have started by describing the sample. So in research you have to describe the sample. Right. So the folks to describe the sample, that has to be one of your specific objectives. Otherwise, so therefore you say it was six social demographic characteristics. Make an Excel of Gano 72.7% plus there, mean age they are set, and then main duration of diabetes. And then percentage of depression was this much. Uh, this is the type of the study methodology, descriptive prospection study. This was exclusion criteria. Using this, is what I said, there is a variated signal and conversion of this question in this. So, that is okay, you can use that already used. So, you can uh, in the methodology say, I'm going to use this. If you can slowly drop off stress and other things and stick to depression, 
you can basically use the same methodology and finish your MD. Right, but we have studied 300 patients, 3,000. That's a large sample. Because I'm sure this is Mandana, I got three hundred. Second question for the second question. Yeah, the second. 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 Yeah, the Deep, what keywords you use, how many articles came, and how you selected the articles you wanted. Right? Otherwise, you will forget. Then, mom, it's a gila make a Right? It was a me article or a random to one picture at a caramel. Because I don't know. Right? And everything that you think is important, download and check. Okay, right? So, because it always, so this is basically what you can do. This I did in Google Scholar, but you can do it in PubMed. Take a academy, make it, make a, may advance search at the la, may walk, check color, cross color, refine color. You can do Only problem is it will take time because once you get the first download the article, then Download and then write the summary. But remember, if you are doing it new, already you have not submitted it, uh, definitely you can use that to submit or prepare the abstract right? Okay, David. Because if you are having another one, uh, my proposal is you have to bring this with you already done a at least one page article and uh, say five slides presentation on for all these areas then we can discuss it each other and uh, come to a conclusion and then within a kind of a some day you can prepare a proposal and submit or do it. Okay. So that is basically the uh, any questions from virtual people? Not Okay, that's, so basically, you have to first download. So, make a gun. Then, make a we can make a So, and basically make an Excel data sheet and say up to the name of the article. Well, we are here. Mm 
So you can say name of the article, year of publication, your publication, you can, you can hold the relevant table, you can put your publication journal. So in the authors, like in the mean author, right? Then the country of and then some percent. And then the other variables that is available in Jacob Sexity again. For the Jada, the Oka, Arakal, and Adam, we can fit. Right? So, the other thing is some percent of these three Lanka countries. Sample and then age mean thing about sample size this is this will increase your sample size you have a general article you have review will have thirty thousand people. So that's another advantage. AVD you build up your reviews and then basically summarize. Then you can say. And the three countries to see you basically uh, covers three countries so we get what the information from Sri Lanka, India and Pakistan in Asia and the total sample size was we said 15,000 and me media may open media and this findings of that kind of thing you can write. I mean, that is for a general review. It can be a little bit different because this review you have to then slowly change. Okay. So one letter, one advice to me. One take home message is don't do uh, how to write research proposals after lunch. Either don't give lunch or stop it with lunch because all of you look so depressed. I feel like crying. <laughs> right. So that is a, a different issue. And the, that is about the literature review. Any questions? Again, this takes time. With the article, you have to read. And this make it make it a bit of time. Now, I'm going to make article So, and then you have to read all of them. And then slowly develop. You can literature. Any questions you can ask? Yes. No, it is it is not subjective because your opinion comes from your review. Then, then, there are 10 articles. Seven articles tells about the seven drug for a disease care. Seven articles tell the drug is good. Three articles tell the drug is bad. So you can conclude, although there are conflicting opinions, majority says the drug is good. And so as a clinician, you decide to be the drug. 
right? Because vomiting is important. The review is for clinicians, you know, for your day-to-day -day practice, for you to decide because you don't have time to read everything, right? It's a leva game. Opinion is not yours. You can't come to the opinion from evidence. Okay, you will get up to make a day key in a cut name. But final question opinion will be yours, but it has to be supported by the findings of the You might always think this is not correct. But if majority tell that it is correct, then you'll have to forget about the opinion because your opinion is from the review. Review tells this is good. Okay. Any other questions? Okay. So that is review. Okay. Then next. Thank you. Presentation. Oh. And uh, again, another uh, one planning for literature review. General reading prepare a list of terms. What is the time frame of search? How far back? Because you are reading 2020 or 2020. Think about the outcome. What it is you want to get out of the search? Management, how are you going to manage the search results? And this can sequence of process to be searched. So it will not only take time, it will take space in your computer and it will take some time to find that process. And then, so we justify the study, we have had a topic, justify the study, develop the objectives, did the literature search, now come to the methodology. Again, this is the sequence or logical thing. So everything is linked and the methodologies basically will help you achieve objectives. So you can't do anything outside. It will come after your thesis. When you are analyzing the data, when you have data, you know statistical package. You want to analyze data in every way and any way that is possible. But that will be restricted the stuff by your objectives. So however much data you have, however much analysis you can do, your analysis you have to stop to achieve your data. There are spaces that now you can put age and sex current pulang age and ethnicity can do age and religion can pulang sex and ethnicity can pulang right you can do any number of comparisons and put lot of tables by your objectives. So your objective doesn't say you are going to compare. You don't have to go and do this two by two table. Okay? So again, this everything is related to your objectives and these are the major parts of methodology. First, you have to write what is the type of the study. So your study is a descriptive study. Your study is a descriptive study and your study is a descriptive. So these are medical studies. Uh, is mainly you can divide into two: observational and intervention. So observational studies, you don't do anything to the participants, as the name implies. You observe what is happening, right? Interventional studies, which are also called experimental studies, 
the researcher go and do something to the participants. Either give a drug, give a food program, something that intervene the natural normal process. And the experimental studies are also can be divided into intervention studies, experimental studies, control clinical trials, control trials, all the Right. Then observation into two. One is descriptive studies, other one is analytical studies. Right. Descriptive studies generate hypothesis. Analytical studies check hypothesis. And the two analytical studies we all of us know is face control and cohort. Cohort is you take a group of people with exposure and without exposure, follow them up for some time to see who develop the disease and who don't develop the disease. Then compare this and try to tell the disease risky one or not. And usually you use relative risk to tell the magnitude of the problem. Case control studies, you take cases and comparable group of controls, then ask whether they were exposed to any factor in the past. Don't remember these cases prospective and retrospective because that at one point in we caused trouble. But one goes from both <clears throat> goes from exposure to disease. But the problem is because you have to depend on the person's remembering power. There is a lot of biases in case control studies. But why they came was because cancer takes about 20 years to develop and about 100,000 risk kicks about 1 in 100,000. So, those are people for 20 years, you get one person, patient. So, that's more probably before the end of therapy, the uh, researcher might be dangerous. So, therefore, case control studies came. Now, again, they are going to prospective studies, but those are the two analytical studies where you can check hypothesis, but they are you only talk about associations, not cause effect relationship. Right? Because more than Lung cancer associated because more people do not get lung cancer than that. But that does not mean smoking causes lung cancer, right? In the descriptive study, there are three types. One is cross-sectional studies, all of the studies are cross-sectional. Then uh, cross-sectional studies, case reports and case series. And the third one is uh, A. Yeah. There here, correlational studies. Correlational studies are done for populations, not individuals. So those are the type of study. And uh, you can write the type of study or the same design for sectional study. Area of the study, you are going to do a tendency study. Uh, then likewise, where you do the study. Then we come to study subjects. So the population and the sample, and then inclusion and exclusion criteria, you have to tell, right? In sample size, you have to actually talk to a statistician to get the sample size. Method of selecting the sample, you know, random sampling and non random selecting are different. Random sampling, there are various ways you can say simple random sampling, then systematic sampling, certified random sampling, and Or there's another uh, random, which is snowballing, you know, consecutive, purposive, those kind of things. And then how do you select the sample? All this you are writing a research proposal. And then data collection, we again talked about the method of data collection, rules of data collection and data collections. Remember, in this study, you need data clearance. Now, no ethical committee gives retrospective clearance. The regular proposal is that study is that the 
So before you really start the study, you have to get ethical clearance. PGIM will not give you the degree. Even if you pass the study, if the ethical clearance was not there. Right? So this is very serious. And then definitely you have to get the permission. And so this is the methodology part. Then, uh, or anyone can tell you a methodology. Most probably, none of you might be able to tell you that because you will actually be telling you that. And we can discuss because then one you will understand how big a endeavor you are going to start, which might not be even physical or practical. Second thing is uh, you will also realize how difficult it is. What the work is that type of study being area of study also okay. Then study subjects also you can some more the test. But because you are studying three things, you have to will have to calculate three sample sizes, and then sample right? because it's three different. You have to put the prevalence of yeah. you sample any you have it right, and then how you are going to select because you, know, you want. Diabetes, and then you are going to you know, from hospitals, and how you are going to select you have to basically tell. Then tools of data collection, you have to have three questionnaires. One you said there is one to collect all three. Yes, yes. Already then you have to tell it looks already validated. Translated question I am going to use. And then you are going to say, we are going to administer the question and by whom. It's nice if you can take one question, I will take 30 minutes or something. One day I, can, I will collect four. So if you are going to go to 400, you have to have 100 days of data collection. Okay? And then who will be the data collector? And then where you are going to get ethical cleaner permission from the direct and whoever it is. Then data entry analysis, then you have to tell. This you have to definitely tell, especially qualitative research. You want also what will be your cutoffs, how you are going to get the cutoffs, how question has to be historic. Uh, mark, given marks, all those you have to tell. In English or single? Okay. So how long will it take uh, for it to just check that? Then uh, this is not for anyone's thing, this is more easily for your information also. You can say one question I administered it, this much time will take. So I plan to administer this much of the sample sizes. Okay. 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 Then you have to tell who's going to collect the data. People or something, they will collect the data and I will monitor you are going to collect the data. And where you are going to collect the data. So all those you will have to tell. And once you get the data, how you are going to enter the data. And then uh, I think most boards of studies want your questionnaires also with your detailed book. Sometimes even the translated versions also they work. Single camel board. You can always say I only do single, then you only need to put single, not some board. And 
Because the uh, most important thing you have to quantify is how long you are going to spend on the image. You don't take another five hundred picture of camera. But with Chile, but twenty patients at data collector and then even you can only do from eight to four. Okay, to go up, then that's about uh, to go and seven hours. Back at Tuna, twenty minutes. Time. But Magadi Tabor Narada and Autumn, it will be cut down towards six hours. And then Nara, Koidi the Karanik in a clinic can have to go article like a social area that we know that for. I mean, more than the proposal, it is good for you or you are collector at your own neck. Is that form? Is that form? What I need question I have information sheet. I mean, good app websites have all those. So, Peradinika, you know, what we do is we download it. The appropriate fortunate care to make the color when color subject. Translation of Kumti number will tell you tomorrow name where a one tick of the data will translate. Questionnaire translation will take time. Tell me, do you know? No, we have to get a person who knows Tamil what we do is translate, then retranslate them. ಅಲ್ಲಿಕೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ <laughs> 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 Thing is, you have to spend time and have to spend money to get the transit. It's very expensive. It was a lava yare kakal mangatinis. Then a transit can be done. When a job can do it, it's very expensive. But the art circle did a salary good up company. So they have. ಸಂಶ್ಲೇಷಣ <laughs> Yeah. Okay, question is we can't ask in English similar Right? Because now you can't read what is in the question. What do I translate? Can I put a way? Can I get a sky? Can I get a sky? Can I get a sky? Because we are not normal people. So, a lot of biases can happen. Again, you can only read when a Mukutan is. ಮೇಕಿಯಾಗ <laughs> ಮೇಕೆ ಅಪ್ಪಿಕೇನ ಕಪ್ಪಿಕೇನ ವಿಜೇತ ಪೇಶಂಟ್ ಕೇಲ್ಲ ದೇವ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ನಮ್ಮ ಪೇನ್ ಸ್ಕೇಲ್ ಲಕ ಇಂದ ಒಕ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಕನ್ನ ಹ್ಮ್ ಬಟ್ ಯು ಆಸ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಆಸ್ಕಿಂಗ್ ಇಫ್ ದೆ ಆಸ್ ಯು ಅ ಕ್ವೆಶ್ಚನ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಕ್ವೆಶ್ಚನ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ವೆರಿಫೈ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಅಡ್ಮಿನಿಸ್ಟರ್ ಫಂಡ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಒನ್ ಟು ವೆರಿಫೈ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿಸ್ Therefore, it has to be the same education level. Identifying information in me. The first part, any questionnaire will have identified information. That is nothing. And if you, you can even not take name, then you can, they can't be contacted. Only issue is 
taking your Miss Kudis, you can again go and talk to them. You have a contact on this. Because you can you always have to tell only you and the other researchers will be shown this data sheet. And after about five years, you are going to destroy the whole thing. So, the 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 but when if you do the same thing, Q and Atta, Q and above, write on the support. Because this reverse check. Again, basically bringing out new data. On an evidence based manner and reliable and accurate data. So, maintain reliability and accurate data. Right? So, the access current is effective, just use it. Yeah. yeah. So, you want to ask the question about the sample size details? So, no, it's not going to be done, but it's not going to be done. Sample size, that sample size have nothing to do with your sample size. Okay. Right? Your sample size is you calculate for your way. Okay. Generally, for the prevalence of the that usually you need about 300 kilo hit again current. But the quantitative one, giving it less. Yeah. You can't do this. Right? You can't do it. Then you have to then all include other hospitals. Then you put a clinical trial save or multi-center current, multi-country and multi-center because there are not enough patients. So to have patients, they go out of the country. That's why there are a lot of inter-country inter collaborations for Kind of studies because they need patients, so then they go to other countries. So then you can do. No, because there are a lot of other diabetic clinics in the country, and you learn to include them. Of course, you can learn to Google it. 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 You can get provided doctors are compliant. We are not. Uh, so you can get the information. Because I have man, I mean, here we are in the local car, Mujerit car, in the local dealer, Katatka level, the year to the high cut, they win. Okay, we don't send. That's a different issue. No, you will have to do that. But I required a Pramath, you know, and said, you have friends in each hospital, you're going to kill every color, who will call them for one of you. No, don't ask them to send anything, you can use a Google form. Me. Then you can involve all the doctors in all the clinics. It doesn't matter no, which clinic they are, because the clinic is clinic and what you do at the diabetic clinic will be the same. Whatever the hospital. Because you are not going to find out about drugs, no. Medicines might be different from hospital to hospital. 
ಅಷ್ಟೇ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ಸ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ 